誰ですか。最悪。You have no right to sell Tony's property. Behold, he has a wife. And take note, all the properties of Tony that you sold, you, you will account for every dime of it. <laughs> you will account for them. Okay. <clears throat> My husband, I just want to let you know that we don't need Jane in this house anymore. Let her go back to her father's house and see if another man will come and marry her. After all, she doesn't have a child for our son. So what are we talking about? Let her not waste her time staying here. She's becoming a nuisance. Veronica, you lie. Jane is legally married to this family. To who? To this family. She's a full member of this house. She was really, really married well. That this meeting is over. Marriage. That this meeting is over. This meeting is over. Are you shouting on me? Okay. You have to be very careful. So, because Tony married her into this family, and now Tony is dead, she has to die here. Okay? My husband, I chop one missing in a copper two. My name I got two. Mm. Unless Eugene decides otherwise, she's a full-blooded member of this house. <laughs> if she wants to go, it's come for her to go. Ah, okay. I I got two. My name I got two. Hey, um, Dad, this meeting is over. This meeting is over. Shut up, mouth. Who are you shouting for? Ah, okay, no problem, Mom. Do I look like Jake? I shout for any help. Okay. What's wrong with you? Don't go and struggle for your personal property. Tony's property. Tony's car. Tony's car. Don't worry, if you soon finish selling them, I'll know what you sell again. One day won't sue, but won't sue. Forget all this ones. Oh, my love. We have not seen her for some days now. I have been worried. So I decided to come and check if she's here. I'm happy to see her here now. I can see she's here. Yes, I can see. <laughs> Jane, how are you? I'm fine, Papa. Papa, sorry. I decided to come and stay here because I can't come. She's 
Oh, come on. Never mind about that. I'm okay seeing you here. Um, don't worry. Nothing will happen to you. Just take good care of yourself. For the sake of the unborn baby, who is my, going to be my grandchild. <laughs> You'll be okay. Okay. I'm very much. Thank you so much. No, no, in law, don't worry about that. You cannot come to your in law's house and not eat No, I will come back again. My wife is here. I will always come. Don't worry, my in law. Don't worry. Don't worry. Oh. I'm just from Holy, I'm missing you. Tony, my love, where are you? Why did you abandon me here? My husband? Please, where are you? You promised me that you will always be there for me. Why did you decide to treat me this way? Why did you decide to leave me alone? <laughs> Please come back to me. I need you back in my life. <laughs> Please, my husband, come back to me. <laughs> If you see what that woman did to me that day, you will pity me. Even her husband could not believe it. I'm so sorry about it. That is how she behaves. But how could she be that wicked? She doesn't even have respect for her own husband. You will be my friend. If I tell you what I am passing through in that house, you will pity me. My dear, hmm? I will advise you to leave that house. This woman will kill you one day. Eh? Is it not your husband's property you're fighting for? Let them have it all. But first of all, save your life. I have gone too far with this fight. I can't quit now. Okay. It's not possible. If you say so, but you have to be very careful. Very, very careful. I'll be fine. Okay. Um. Have you eaten anything since morning? No. Okay, let's go inside so that my sister will go and buy food for you. Okay. Concerning my son, because I don't want to start calling you a shawo. Just get out. Just go. Never. Oh. I've 
I've come to tell you that whenever you are done with this shit, you should reserve it for me. Hey! 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 Whenever I am done with my shop, I should keep it for you. Did you hear that? I heard that. Get out. I don't want problems. Just get yes. out. I said you should get out now. Shower. Get. What have I done that you're embarrassing me this afternoon? Oh. Haven't you heard that? Leave here. I shower. Wait, oh. You're talking about embarrassment. Oh, we better if if. Now you get it. Get out. Get out. Mama, leave me. I said, get out, my friend. Get out. Get out. I shower. I shower. Get out. I shower. Mommy, come back. Mommy, stop your stuff. Come back. Don't come back here. Don't come back here. Next time you come here, come back. I shower. Come back. I shower. I should leave my shop for you. Imagine, though. Yes, I'm coming. Excuse me. Yeah. The vendor just bought it. Alright. Um, Miss Jen is here to see you. Miss Jen? Yeah. Ask her. Okay. I'm so sorry I was delayed by the traffic. There's no problem, there's no problem. Um, actually, uh, the barrister was here, Barrister Dan. Yes, he was here when I told him to come over. I'm so sorry, I didn't meet up. It's okay. He told me he has secured the court injunction to stop work over that piece of land. Hmm. Yes. And he yes. also said he has um, filed a lawsuit against the Geofani's mother. So when is the first hearing? Um, on the 24th of next month, barely a month from now. That's good. And uh, my happiness is we have the original documents to those properties. <laughs> but thank you so much for your concern. You've been of great help to me. It's okay, Jen. Your husband is my very good friend. In fact, we are brothers. That's good. But yes. I want to go to the hospital for checkup. I've not been feeling too well. Okay, it's very necessary. Very necessary. Um... Um, Jim, take this. No, Pat. You've already done too much for me. Please. Jane, nothing. Nothing is too much. You are my best friend and wife. And in case there's any other thing you need, just let me know. Alright? Just get it. Thank you. It's okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. And, um, have you had lunch today? You need drink, food, anything? Pat. I'm okay, thank you. No, 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 you must take lunch before oh. You must take lunch before going. It's okay. Um, Grace!
My daughter, this is your pregnant. Yes, ma'am. But the thing is that I'm confused. Confused about? Confused over what? Please be happy, my darling. Be happy. This is good news. Be happy. Mama. Ha, of course you should be happy. Didn't they say you're not a woman? And God finally proved them wrong and made you a superwoman. Oh, Nemo. God, thank you. Papa, thank you. You have done it for me. They've wiped your shame. God has made you. Mama, you don't understand. Understand what? How am I going to convince them that Tony is responsible for my pregnancy? Jane. Ma. Do you have another husband? What need you have to argue with them? Your husband pregnanted you. Please, my darling. This is good news. Celebrate with me. Ow! Otalo gidio. Otalo Ow! God has made me so proud. The truth is, I don't know how to tell my, my husband people about this. Have you told Pat about it? Not yet. You're the second person I'm telling after my mother. My dear, there is nothing to it. There's no two ways about the whole thing. The truth is you're pregnant for your husband, you're pregnant for your husband. Eh? If I were you, I would be happy just the way your mother said. Listen, being happy about it is not the problem. But I don't know how they will react. They will react towards this. Honestly. Okay, let's do it this way. Hmm? Maybe you should tell your father-in-law first. What about that? I think that's a nice idea. Um, concerning the money I promised you the other day you came. My dear, it's just 10,000 naira. So, just manage it for now. Maybe when next you come, I'll make it up. Hmm? Please. At least for your feeding. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. Please, eh? Make sure you eat good food from now on. Eh? You know you're pregnant. Hmm? I will. It's okay. Thank you. Okay. Alright, let me get going. Alright, no problem. Take From Jane. Dad, Jane is leaving this house today. What has Jane done again? Every time Jane, 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 Jane. What is it again? Dad, Jane has the cause to place court injunction on that piece of land. <laughs> I laugh for you because I can't cry for you. If owner of property is fighting legally to claim his or her property, is it a crime? The property legally or otherwise belong to Jane. Ah. Yes. Is that why you're ranting? <laughs> oh, that's why you're ranting. <laughs> I pity you. Is that what you're saying, Dad? I mean? I've already said it. Ah. Jane, I've been enjoyed enough from you. I'm giving today and tomorrow to go and lift that court injunction. Or we leave this house. Hey, Joffa, leave which house? The one you built or don't I build? If you want to be a chief commander, go and be the owner and put women there. Ah. Jane goes no, nowhere. Ah, okay. Let's see. Jane! Yes. Ah, I mean. Jane! 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 I'm gonna be walk home. I'm gonna be walk home. Okay. Can you do that outside? Look at him. <laughs> Daddy, please leave it. Leave it now. What kind of man is this? Jane, 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 Jane. That is okay. 
Does he want to take over, 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 over the marriage? Hey, Daddy. It's okay, please leave it, Jeff. Daddy, I would like to discuss something with you this evening. Okay, okay. That's, that's okay. Um, you're looking very tired. I am. Okay, just go and rest. Just go and rest. Hmm? Okay, Daddy. Hope my baby's kicking. <laughs> Very well. <laughs> Just go and rest. Good morning, sir. Good morning, Mr. Mark. Where are you? Um, I'm from the court, sir. What do you want to see? Um, I'm looking for Miss Dejo Four or Mrs. Veronica. Is there anything the matter? Um, I have a message for them. Can I have it? Please, can you sign here for me, sir? This is unbelievable. Do you mean you are pregnant for my son? Yes, Papa. Oh, this is good. This is good. Come on, come on, come on, hold me. Give me a hug. Come on, just give me a hug. <laughs> this is good, beautiful. <laughs> oh, that's my daughter-in-law. Please sit down, sit down. This is really good. Is that why you're worried? I should do. Come on, chill up. Let me see that face smile. Come on. Give me a smiling face. <laughs> that's it. That's it. You're there. You're there. I'm happy. Don't you think this might settle the differences in the family? Please, don't wear that blue face. Keep on smiling. Be happy. Is that okay? I'm really happy in my mind. Is that okay? Oh, this is good. This is beautiful. My son, it is not the person that calls the police that wins the case. But I'm still very grateful, very happy that the money you realize from the sale of the land is still intact. We can actually influence the judgment. Oh, which money is still intact? Are you not aware I put the whole money into my business? What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> huh? Hey, Jeffo. Mom is right, oh. Me too, I need money. You think it will be like the other one you sold the cows and ate the money yourself? Organize it. Ah! Shut up. Need money. Which one is shut up? Eh? You. <laughs> Take a look at this. <laughs> What's this? Uh, take a look at this. <laughs> what do I put in my eyes? <laughs> mm. 
Jane is pregnant? That's just a story. For who now? For her son. Which your son? Tony. The one that died many months ago. Oh, please. Incredible. Hmm? Wonders shall never end. Look at this one. Incredible. Wonders shall never end. Our son, Tony, owns this pregnancy. Jane is a member of this house and she remains so. Um, Keep Dad. on struggling for car keys and all what not. <clears throat> Dad, if Jane is really pregnant, Pat is responsible for it. <laughs> shut up. Shut your mouth up. Which one is shut up? Why must he say such a thing that Pat is responsible? Is Jane a prostitute? Look, Jeffrey, be careful. Why are you so gullible? Isn't it obvious? Uh, huh? The day they will see you for slander, don't call me, don't call anybody. What is wrong with you? Uh, my son Tony owns that pregnancy, that's all. Uh, Why are you so gullible? <laughs> you because you are a real man. You have done what my brother cannot do. <laughs> what are you talking about? Your wife, I mean, your girlfriend is pregnant. What? <laughs> uh. How does this concern you? Uh, Mr. Patrick, whether you accept the responsibility or not, Jen is pregnant for you. You have only tomorrow to come and take her to your house or I will throw her out of my house. Enough! Now listen to me, young Take this false fabricated result of accusation and get the hell out of my office! I'm not done. Also, I advise her to withdraw the suit from the court because I have an evidence against her. You see, um, this pregnancy test shows that both of you are working hand to hand to take one belong to my family. After then, she will not get married to you. I wish I can allow it to happen. <laughs> get out. See, um, I said get out! After tomorrow, I will drive her out of my house. But I know you will not allow that to happen because you love her. <laughs> <laughs> Jane is pregnant and I did not know about it. Oh God. Is this true? test result and accuse me of being responsible. What kind of embarrassment is that? But you mean it you fucking came to your office? Yes. I'm so sorry about that. Please, where are you? We need to talk. Are you still in the office? I am. I was about going out when you bought it. Okay. Tell me the address of where you're going to. I'll come and join you this one. It's all right. It's all right. All right. I have come to.
tell you people that your daughter is pregnant. Ogum, I am one. We are aware. And we've been thanking God for that. Because God has been so faithful to us. It's your own. Oh yes, madam. I actually I was so happy when I had it. Oh. <laughs> I'm sure she did not tell you who got her pregnant. She did now. Oh Tony now, her husband. Exactly. Yes. Which Tony? Your son. <laughs> <laughs> well, I am sorry to tell you that she lied to you. She did not tell you the truth. It was her husband's best friend that got her pregnant. <laughs> what? Hey, my in-law. That is not true. It's a lie. Huh. Um, um, madam, oh. I'm not here to argue with you. Tell your daughter to leave my house. Tell her to leave my house without that photo. I will throw her out. I will throw her out. I will give up. 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 Mama, how could she? Why would Jane do a thing like this? Why? How could she want? Doka, don't be deceived by, you, by Veronica and her son. Jane is pregnant by her husband, Tony. Have you forgotten how they want to throw her away from that house since? Please, don't even go there. Mommy, did you see Koro? Veronica, no, 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 I'm not even worried about her. Jane, I didn't know you were pregnant. How come you never told me about it? I'm so sorry about that. I only went to the hospital for checking. That's why I found out I was pregnant. It's okay. I'm happy for you. And uh, I want you to be very, very careful. Try as much as possible to avoid any conflict if because of your presence in your situation. You know they are not happy about it. Um, let me take you back home. I'm running it. No I'm still going back to the office. No problems. All right. Thank you. It's okay. I just hope you've not come here to do another allegation on me. Um, please, uh, Jen, 
I'm not here to accuse you of anything. I'm only here to, to talk to you. I want us to end this problem once and for all. If only you will cooperate with me. Say what you have to say. Um, Jen, you're a young woman with bright future. Stay in this house as a widow cannot do you any good. What's that? Uh, this is a check of one million naira. I urge you to withdraw that case from the court. Leave this house. Start a new beginning, a new hope. There are so many men out there who can be interested to marry you. Stay in this house. We only deny you the opportunity to meet them. Take that thing you hold and leave this room. I am not interested in settling with you. Now get out. Hello, am I speaking with Tony Eguatu's wife? Yes, who is this? My name is Bemson. I have a message for you. A message for me? Please, we can't discuss it over the phone. Do you know the state secretariat? Yes. I am somewhere behind there. Call me with this number when you get there. Please, be there before 2 p.m. Um. When we get to the other side of the road. Okay. You can call him now.
I know you must be wondering how I got your number and why I wanted to see you. Mm -hmm. I actually came in from the capital city last night. Your husband sent me to you. What? My mm -hmm. husband? Tony? Yes. Please, where is he? We've been looking for him. He has been in the police net all this while. Police? What happened? It's a long story. Go on. Very long story. Please tell us. Tell us. Your husband's business partners framed him up and got him arrested on the day he was about to travel. Oh my God. What happened was oh their boss stopped over at the fuel station to get gas. He didn't know these men were following him with some police officers. So they got him arrested and took him to the capital city. At least my husband is still alive. Pat, this is unbelievable. I told all of you that my husband is alive, but you insisted that he is dead. I know that the God I serve will never, will never disappoint me. Um, nah, please. Why didn't he call us? I mean, he should have called me, even me, his wife. He could not. Because they bribed the police to keep him in confinement. What? Yes. These same people bribed the police? And he has been in a solitary room all this while. Without communication. Even not for the intervention of the police commissioner. Hmm? The commissioner paid a surprise visit to the command and discovered about your husband while going around the command blocks. He then ordered the DPO to charge the case to court immediately. Good. 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 That was when your husband was brought to cell where we met, became friends, and he told me everything that happened to him. It is the grace of God that kept him in confinement. Hey. Oh, Jesus. So, what, what are they thing? accusing him of? I'm robbery and kidnapping. Jesus. That's a what? huge accusation. Yes. I was freed yesterday, so your husband asked me to come and see you, since I can't discuss everything over the phone. You need to get him a lawyer as soon as possible. I'll do that now. It's very important. Thank you so much. God will bless you. God, I thank you. I thank you that my, my husband is still alive at least. Thank you. Oh, God. <laughs> Just allow her to finish the story, please. Uduk. Allow me to dance unto my God. Mm. Allow me to rejoice in the presence of my God. Eh? Mm. Ma, God loves you. Yes, so. You go for again. So what next? Okay, Mama. Mm? I made an arrangement with Mr. Pad and a lawyer. Okay. We'll be going to the capital city first into my mind. Hey! Oh, wow. It's like a dream. Mm. Oh, but Jane, your hot pants people are very wicked. <laughs> Mama. Are very, very wicked. Mama, look at who is talking. So you just realize that now. Mm. This is my brother. Mm. I hope you have told your husband's people about this. Mm. Mm. No, Mama. I won't tell them. Well, quickly tell them. Tell them to shame the devil. Tell them! I won't tell them. My major concern right now is the allegation leveled against my husband at that police station. Oh, that's just my concern. My daughter, don't worry. God is already in control. Because that God has started this fight. He fight it till the end. Yes. He started this work, he will perfect it. Amen. He will not leave it in the midst of process. Amen. Amen. Don't worry, he's taking charge, okay? Uh, okay, Mama. Amen. So, uh, did you tell him that you're pregnant? Mm -hmm. No, not yet. But come on, he's my husband, I'll tell him. Oh, good, good. Tell him now. <laughs> Mama, I will tell him. Oh, my God, I am <laughs> not... Oh, God, I am very, very... 
Those men that came up with these charges, have the police been able to get them? Uh, yes. After the police commissioner's visit, this command has made you know, several attempts on that. Nevertheless, we are still you know, making serious efforts on that to you know, apprehend the, the people by God. Sir. As it stands now, what's my husband's fate? The case has been charged to court. Right now, the court has a final say. Your husband will make his first appearance in court in five days' time. Okay. Well, Dipio, you, you see, we've heard all you've said. Hmm? And we appreciate all of your effort once again. You're welcome. Yeah. We have to take our leave. Well, I wish you good luck. But mother, don't worry. Not what happened to your husband. As long as his hands are clean. Thank you very much, DP. Thank you. Abu!
of those documents here. What do you mean? Uh, did you search very well? Yes. Because this is the only place they can hide everything. I'm having that feeling that those papers are not in this house. You know that girl is smart. She must have taken them away. Did you search the living room properly? Yes, mom. I, I, mom, I have searched everywhere. Hi. So what are we going to do? Uh, by the way, does your lawyer know that the papers you gave to him are fake? No. In that case, we have to tell him more. We have to tell him since we cannot find the original as we thought. No, Mom. I will look for that girl wherever she runs to. She must provide those papers or I'll kill her. Mama, Mama, come on, dear way. Please, so you will do no such thing. Please. Please. So wicked to your daughter in law who is pregnant for your son. How can you? How dare you? Go and bring her back. Who is she pregnant for? For Tony, of course. What the hell? If any lawman are to one year, you say I'm wicked. That girl is more wicked. I mean, how could she have that kind of effrontery to drag my, my son and I to, to court over my own son's property? If I ever see her in this house. You lied. You lied and you will see. You too you will see. see. You will see too. How dare you? Okay, little dad. Why do you find it so difficult to believe that that stupid Jane is a bad woman? Come on, shut up your mouth. Shut up your mouth. Like daughter, like mother. Eh, eh, let it be. At least somebody is like me. Who are you opening that gate for? Love it. See, I don't like that joke. Please. 
But I'm not joking, it's true! Mom, you look for it and I just saw him, I'm not joking! You know, for someone who has been in a police cell for a very long time. I understand. Hmm? But have you told him about the pregnancy? Mama. I will tell him. Hmm? He's my husband. You're wasting time. And the thing is just <laughs> to keep me, to keep me. Mama, I will tell him. Don't worry. But uh, Jake. Mama. You know you have not told me how he regained his freedom. Tell me now. Mama. Hmm? It's a long story. <laughs> Make it short, tell me, make it short. When God says yes, nobody can say no. Heaven and earth, nobody can say no. Anyways, let me tell you the story now. One of his accusers confessed mm. that the allegation leveled against my husband was a frame up. Hey! Tell me something. <laughs> no one knows. Mama, he stated that they were jealous of my husband because he was more prosperous in business than them. So they connived to eliminate my husband. He that has God has everything. Yes, He that loves God that puts his trust in the arms of the Lord. One with God is majority. And he that put his trust in the Lord will not be put to shame. Ow! Mama, after his confession, the judge had no other option but to release my husband. Do you know the sweetest part of all this? Mm -hmm. Tell me! All the people involved, mm -hmm. including the policemen, have been sentenced to 21 years in prison. Hey! We are to win. Mama. Obere Bumburo, we ya. It is true that a lot of water has passed under the bridge. I have to appeal to you to please be calm. I know we can recover some of these properties. That that was not be calm. A geophone must tell me why he sold all my cows and my land and what he did with the money. To even think he was happy with the news that I was dead. No. That one is a lie. Whoever told you that is a liar. Can you hear me? Hey, Jofo, speak for yourself now. Um, my brother Tony, I'm happy that you're back. And I'm, I'm sorry for disposing your properties. And you know I have a reason for doing that. Tell him the reason and stop wasting time. Um, 
Tony, my brother, uh, please. It was not pre-planned to sell any of your properties. Uh, I thought it wise to do so when I saw what was about to happen. Jen here started having an affair with your best friend, Pat. Jesus Christ! You see, Jesus! After... Uh, you better say the truth, though! Stop lying! You better say the truth Shut now! Up. Let him finish. Continue. Uh, Tony, only God knows I'm saying the truth. Mm, Pat planned with her to sell all your properties. After that, he will not marry her. Hey, Jofo, stop that rubbish! Stop that rubbish! How is it like? Hey, Jofo, go punish you for lying against You're me! You're already punished. Hey, Oni, is it lie, yo? Is it lie? Oni, I can explain. See, I wanted to tell you this night. Brother, Ejofo is right. Whoa. This mad woman called Jane is pregnant for Pat. She made him mad. Eh? He, she has not told you. Jane, you are pregnant. She is pregnant. I'm sorry, I can't explain. Anthony, please listen to your wife. Listen to her. Not all this. Honey, listen, listen. See, eh? I can explain everything. Just give me the chance. I'm... Please, my husband. I, I do not need your explanation. You are very wicked and senseless. How can you claim to love me yet to sleep with my best friend? Knowing what I was going through, you are evil. No, I didn't do that. How can I? Go tell that to the vets. Do you know what I saw in that police cell? Do you know the torment and heartbreak and emotional trauma I went through? And you had the effort to, to go sleep with my best friend? And you were even happy that I was dead? No. No, my love. They were the ones happy over your death. Not me. How can I? Listen to me. I have told you my mind. Start packing your things this night because tomorrow morning you're going back to your mother's house. And that's how it is. <laughs> Veronica, go up there and tell your son the whole truth. Uh, what other whole truth are we talking about? He knows the truth already. Mm. Uh -huh. You have not told your son anything. Go and tell him everything about the incident, please. So that there will be peace in this house. If why you are saying all these things, is because of that girl Jane. She is leaving this house. She will leave and I will get another wife for my son. Such thing can never happen in this house. It will never happen. Jane is an integral member of this house. It remains so. I don't want to sound disrespectful. I don't want anybody to say I don't respect my husband. If not, I would have told you to bet me. Oh, bet you me. You want to bet me? She will leave home. She, she will leave. She goes nowhere. She is not going anywhere. She belongs here. Wait, oh, just respect yourself. Respect yourself. D don't force me to tell our son that you, you know about, about Jane's relationship with Pato. <laughs> don't let me tell him that you're in support of it, oh. Veronica, you are known for fantastic lies. Is that okay? Look, let me warn you. Your reward awaits you. Oh, your reward awaits you for all your lies and everything you have been doing. Just bet it. Mark it. Why are you judging me now? I'm not judging you. I'm telling the truth. The Bible says, judge not so that you will not be judged. Oh my God. Look Why are you it. judging me? Look how he's talking about the Bible. You, Veronica, the Bible. <laughs> I laugh for you because I can't cry for you. You talking about the Bible. I will deal with you. Please, I can explain. See, Pat is not responsible for my pregnancy, please. Then go to whoever is responsible for your pregnancy. Tony. Anthony. 
Look, you will regret what you are doing now. Papa, I will not regret anything. Do not say I didn't want you. I've let her go to whoever got her pregnant. I cannot cohabit in this house with, a, with an adulterous woman. No! Please, now. We can't sort out this issue. We cannot sort out anything. Mom, tell this woman to get out of this house. Mama. Tell her to get out of this house. Mama. Let this woman be. Papa, please don't interfere in this. Let her be. I am, I am begging you in God's name, don't interfere in this. Papa, can you stop telling me this? Forgive this girl, I don't think she has even committed anything. She's patient. She's an adult woman. I can't give her in my house. It's okay. It's alright. Um, let it be in your care. I'll demand for it tomorrow. Oh, Tony. Don't you dare mention my name. What is the problem? Are you asking me? I you the devil to have betrayed your best friend. What are you talking about? Not only were you, were you sleeping with my wife, you also got her pregnant. What? Ah! What are you talking about? Are you mad? Tony! I don't ever want to see you around my, 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 me again. The next time I find you around me, I will kill you. Do I look like I'm alright? Get out from here! What is the problem? I have never seen Tony in such manners. Something is wrong. Oh my god. My son, please take it easy. It's not the end of your life. Oh? I'm just grateful to God that finally he has exposed the evil ones amongst us. Mom, I feel betrayed. I understand, son. That was why I said it is not the end of your life. Forget about her. There are so many women out there, wife materials. I can actually help get one who will bear you so many children. So calm down. Oh? Mm. Please come and eat. No, I'm not hungry, thank you. Ijofo has come to the bank to pay money into your account. Money from the sale of the land. The remaining part of it, he will pay instrumentally as he promised. Okay. So my son, let's go to the dining. Jane to this house. That child she's carrying in her womb belongs to you. What do you mean that I got her pregnant? Yes, of course. You got her pregnant before you embarked on that trip. What are you talking about that? I have lived with this woman all these years in this house. She didn't get pregnant. Suddenly I disappear and she's pregnant. What do you make of it? Look, Anthony, you are the one that implemented her before your trip. Spare me all those details, Father. I have taken a decision and so it remains. Please. Antony. Antony. Huh. Okay. Mama, I was no more him in the new war called Golo Wokonazo. So, so we are called Golo Boom Kubu Nafo. So, what I am talking in a sense is that Jane 
she will tell us the truth. If she is dating Pat or not. Which truth? Are you suspecting my daughter, my own daughter? Did you hear what I said? Don't you dare shout at me. Neither Abuala. Your blood sister came here and told that she's pregnant for her own husband. And you came up with this stupidity. Oh, were you there? Were you there when they did the thing? Answer me, were you? Mama, each time I raise a good subjection in this house, you always kick against it. Mama, let me ask you, am I not old enough? Am I not a man? Shut up. Shut up. Don't worry. The truth will surely come out. The truth will come out someday. <laughs> Hey. So my new sickness is Udoka. I want to lie down here. You've been lying here since morning. Get up so that you'll be able to eat something and take your drugs. Get up so that you'll be able to eat something. You know you're eating for two. Because of the living in your room, you eat something. Eh? I'm not hungry. And I'm not interested in this baby anymore. It's even better for this baby to die. Jose, why are you talking like that? The gift God just gave you to wipe away your shame? Ah, don't ever say that. Don't reject this gift God gave you. Don't reject your baby. Even if the father rejected the baby, don't. Don't you know that is a consolation? God gave me and you to of us. You should be glad and happy about it. Oh, um, come and eat something and shame the devil. Eh? No, ma. Come and eat. Oh, um, don't cry. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay, my baby. It's okay. Oh, um, um, come and eat. Because for me, even if for nothing, just for me, haven't I suffered enough? Eh? Haven't I suffered enough? Oh, um, So you mean the husband fought you in your office? He did. Yes. And I have never seen him in such ranting manners. This is unfair. And what about the, the wife? I don't know. Maybe he has sent her away. This is not good. After all she has been through in that house, in trying to secure his properties, this is really unfair. Well, that's by the way, Barrister. I came here to inform you that I am no more interested in that court case. Fine, I know I have spent a lot, but there is no problem. But if Jane insists, or if she is still interested, you can carry on. As for me, I can up. Well, if you are no longer interested, I understand. Meanwhile, I will wait for her to call me. Or better still, uh, if she's interested, I think she will call me to tell me the situation of things and I will try as much as possible to communicate this situation to her whenever she calls. It's okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome. It's alright. Um, thanks a lot. It's okay. My regards to your family. Alright. All right. Hey, Bobby. Because um, Help me beg her to something. For the past three days, she has not tested anything. Is that the best option for this whole matter? Is it? 
Jane, why are you now? Eh? Do you want to kill yourself and the baby in your room? Mama, please get her food. I don't want to eat. Hey. Mama, I said get her food. Why are you doing this to yourself? Yeah? Why? Listen, let me tell you. Yeah? What am I still doing in your life? It's now. Hey, is it not better I just die and go my way? Stop saying this now. Stop saying this. Wash your hand. Jenny, uh, stop it now. It if you now. want to kill me, stop eh? now. Wash your hand and eat food. Why are you this mean eh? to me? Eh? Why are you doing this to me? See your mother. Tony. What did I do to receive this kind of treatment from you? Yeah, it's okay. It's now. It's now. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. It's now. This is my gain now that Jane has gone back to her parents' house. My mom is desperate to get another wife for Tony. My dad used to tell me that the measure I used on another person, same measure will be used on me. Honestly, Jane is a good woman. Imagine what we made her pass through when we thought brother was dead. Take your drugs now. Eh? Hey! Mama, eh? I don't want to take yours. So now, take your drugs? Do you want to die? Look at me, Tim Nansubu. I'll come here and make. My love. 
What is the problem? Who are you asking? Me? Move is there any problem with her? Join me also. She has a very high temperature. Uh. Have she taken drug? Egwatu, you're asking me. Carol, why are you so hostile? Jane is still my son's wife. Mm. Look at her. She's dying. Nothing will happen to her. Nothing. Is it even good you take? So that you take my message to Veronica and her useless son. Take a look at her. If anything should happen to her, God will punish all of you. God will punish all of you. My in-law, it has not come to this. Your son disappeared. You know what she went through, how she suffered. Now that he appeared, this is how you want to pay her. My in-law, my in-law, I have been playing a very good role as a father-in-law to your daughter. Really? She's here to My understand. woman. Well, let me tell you. All this is you people are doing to this girl. To this my daughter. Oh man, don't know man. Oh no, okay, me and woman. All right. Oh, no, okay, me and woman. You are still my lord tomorrow. Oh, no, okay, Nothing will happen to Carol. Not to help. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. My woman. You know, on, on my end, man. You were there. What did you do? What did you do as a man? I still insist. Not will happen to her. There is no problem. Carol will get up. Oh, no. Just let me get her some drugs. Right? I'm coming back. Let me get her some drugs. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Well, I heard about the problem you had with my friend Jane. Your friend is a disgrace to womanhood. Did she tell you she was pregnant for my friend? I must tell you the truth. I was the second person Jane showed the medical results the day she went for the pregnancy test. Please, consider the month of the pregnancy. And you will come to realize that Jane, my friend, is innocent of whatever you're accusing her of. You can go ahead and defend her. I don't care, after all, she's your friend. But I have taken a decision. I'm making arrangements to marry another woman. And nothing on earth can change it. Have a nice day. Mr. Come do this thing for me. Mom, which blessing are you talking about? Ah, listen now, that one that her mother usually comes here. That beautiful one. Mm -hmm. I can't remember her. But um, what was Tony's opinion? Hey. <laughs> Tony likes her. I saw the way he was. He was giving her eyes like this. Hmm. Uh, 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 that is not the point. The point is that I want to know if Tony really likes her or not. So that if uh, Tony does not, you can search for another alternative. He likes her a lot. Uh, Dad, when did you come in? Oh. Well, how are you going to talk to this house now? There are a lot of entrance to the house. We know. Vero. Hmm? Vero. Now sit down. Sit down now. Forget about me sitting down. Yeah. You are here rejoicing with your children. Why Jane is lying critically ill there? Look, if anything should happen to that girl, if anything should happen to her, well, the blood shall be upon you. Hey! <laughs> 
Eh? What? Where can I find River Niger? Let me jump inside. Because she's not feeling. I can't do it. I can't do it. They're gonna hear it. Mama, let her stand up and take her drugs. The drugs I bought in the morning. Eh? Let her get up. Jane! Jane! Please, now, get up and take your drugs, please. Doga. Mama? Don't you think we should take her to the hospital now? Hospital? Yes. By this time of the night? No, Mama, it's not, it's not possible. That's why I want her to take her drugs. Jim, please, get up and take your drugs now, please. Mm, because they are not been easy and again, more way, oh? Be gone, them. What kind of trouble is this? Mama, you have to go and get something for her to eat. At least, let me try and force her to eat something. Uh, Jane, please, get up. Get up and eat something, after which you take your drugs, please. Oh, my sister, please. Look, I'm tired. I'm tired. I don't understand what is happening here. What is happening in this house? Mama, I don't understand what is happening. Jane. Jane, my sister. You are here rejoicing with your children. Why Jane is lying critically ill there? Look, if anything should happen to that girl, if anything should happen to her, well, the blood shall be upon you. I wanted to tell you. Uh, why didn't you tell me at all? I didn't want us to discuss it. That was the reason I chose to follow you. Please, I'm sorry for disturbing you. <laughs> okay, I'm listening. But, uh, please, can you pack so I can tell you what I have to tell you? It's very important. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm telling you this, but 
My conscience keeps blaming me. I try to sleep, but I can't sleep. I have to tell you this. What exactly are you talking about? It's about your wife. She's not having any affair with Pat. We actually made up the allegation so that you can chase her out of the house. She has suffered a lot when you were not around. She suffered so much. You know, she did not even believe the news about your death. We were the ones that were happy, especially mom. It was a setup. And mom was happy about my death. Yes, that's the truth of it. All I have to tell you is that your wife is pregnant for you. Yes, she is. And Uncle, she's a good woman. Brother, trust me, she's honest. She's pregnant for you. Bring her back home. She's a good woman. You cannot get her type of person. Trust me. Can you say this before, Mom? Yes, brother. And so many other things that I've not told you. I knew it was all a frame up. I knew it. Love it. Are you mad? Are you if you dare touch her, I will break your head. Now you get ready to provide your money, the three of you, or you will go to jail. Hey. Hey, Lovett. Lovett, what have I ever done to you? What? That he tell this woman to leave me alone. I'm sorry, one big one, I'm sorry, big one. My husband, please help me, beg him. Don't let me lose my daughter. 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 Don't let
Jenny. Which hospital? Get to the camera. No, no, just now. No, no. Okay, just let me inform the, the doctor. Okay, please do, eh? You can inform the doctor. You'll be alright, okay? You'll be fine, you know? Mama, please find it in your heart to forgive me. I, I know I'm responsible for Jen's situation, but please, you don't have to blame me much. My mother deceived me. You see? And she almost died. I'm sorry. That's all she's going through. I'm sorry, you. I'm sorry, Mama. I know, I, I know I've hurt you so much. I've come to beg for forgiveness. I've reconciled with my mom, age of one, love it. And we want you back as one big family. Please, please come back home. Oh. Tony. Tony, would you have had this opportunity to come and talk to me? If I had died in your hands. Tony, I loved you as my husband. But what did you do? You kicked me out of your house. Sorry. Tell me, where haven't I been faithful to you? Please, it's, it's, it's the work of the devil. And I believe we can overcome this. Mama, please help me. Please now, help me beg her. Oh, Ikon. Tony, it is over between. Hey, don't say this to me, it's not fair. Tell your people to get you another wife. I don't want any more. No, I don't want any other wife. You're the one I want. If you leave me, I will die, Bikono. Please, Mama, say no, 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 Bikono. Jane, Jane. please. So long he has realized his mistake, please forgive him. Forgive him. Papa. I've made up my mind. No, no, no. Now, my daughter, no. please. Don't make up I, your mind. No, Biko, I take all the blames. Biko, what are you doing? What Forgive us. Me? All my antique, Veronica, you're begging me. Me, the dirty woman. Please, auntie, please. Please. Listen to him. Please. Please, please Jen. Please, we are sorry. Uh, we are very, very sorry. Biko, I've got one for him. How can you work with man? The almighty Joffa is even begging. Yes. Hey, not killing us and throwing us away again. No, Mama. Hey. Who does he kill you with? Uh, where? Jay, if Pat can forgive Hello. Tony, why don't you forgive your husband? Please. 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 To err is human and to forgive mm -hmm. divine. Mm -hmm. The fine woman, she has apologized. Hmm? Mm -hmm. You should look at him and forgive. Only them barrow one. Oh, barrow. Oh, only them forgive them. They have apologized. 
Change, but my love. 